So I just repeated the experiment with the artificial horizon, but this time using time-lapse mode so that you can see the corrections occurring much faster. And the other thing I wanted to touch on was just a couple of points that were raised in my first video. Firstly, the table absolutely is not level, and you can see that in this small bubble level. It's a plastic table and it's just got a bit of a bow in the middle. It's not much, but it was causing a slight inaccuracy in the artificial horizon. But the other reason it was not showing perfectly wings level is because this white front plate is not perfectly square to the artificial horizon itself. So what was happening is when the plate was level on the table, the actual instrument itself was rotated slightly. So I've corrected that just with a bit of foam padding here and using a bubble level on top so that the actual instrument itself is perfectly level and that results in much more accurate indications on the instrument. The other question that was raised is why are the corrections occurring faster in one direction than they are in the other? Well if the earth was stationary they would probably be occurring at about the same rate both ways but we're not on a stationary earth. It's rotating. I'm at south 34 latitude and that is going to have an effect on this instrument because the corrections are going to be faster in one direction than they are in the opposite direction. And that's what we definitely see in my first video and we see it in this video also.